The Maserati Gran Turismo is a luxurious sports car that has been renowned for its design, performance, and prestige. Maserati has chosen to convert the Gran Turismo to an electric car, EV, in the modern world, where EVs are becoming more and more well liked. So, before starting the video, please like this video. Do subscribe and turn on the notification to our channel for future updates. The newest Gran Turismo model, the Maserati Gran Turismo EV, claims to provide the same level of performance and luxury as its forerunners while being ecologically responsible. In order to better understand the Maserati Gran Turismo EV, this essay will examine its specifics, including its characteristics, performance, and market influence. Design the Maserati Gran Turismo EV incorporates contemporary electric car components while maintaining the Gran Turismo's traditional design language. The automobile has a low, slung front end, a large grille with the Maserati Triton logo, and sharp lines that give it an aggressive appearance. Its bodywork is sleek and aerodynamic. The car also has carbon fiber hood, retractable spoiler, and tiny LED headlamps for better aerodynamics. The car's overall aesthetic oozes elegance and luxury, and the electric vehicle, EV, version looks just as nice as the version powered by an internal combustion engine, ICE. Interior The Maserati Gran Turismo EV's interior is just as spectacular as its looks. The car's roomy interior and premium materials give it a luxury appearance. A 10.1 inch touchscreen infotainment system in the automobile shows important data including range, battery life, and charging status. Additionally, the system supports Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, enabling seamless smartphone connectivity for drivers. The vehicle also has a panoramic sunroof, heated and ventilated seats, and a premium audio system. Features Numerous features that improve the driving experience are included in the Maserati Gran Turismo EV. A potent electric motor with 540 horsepower and 730 newton meters of torque is installed in the vehicle. The vehicle is among the fastest EVs available, reaching 100 km per hour in less than 2 seconds. The vehicle's top speed of 200 km per hour is remarkable for an EV. The 800 volt battery pack in the car has a range of more than 320 km on a single charge. The vehicle can also be charged quickly, with a DC fast charger enabling a charge of up to 80% in just 20 minutes. The car also has regenerative braking, which recovers energy during deceleration, improving the car's range. Performance Performance-wise, the Maserati Gran Turismo EV is excellent and stays true to the Gran Turismo name. Instantaneous torque is produced by the car's electric motor, resulting in a smooth and rapid acceleration. The car handles well, reacts quickly, and feels stable at high speeds. The car's suspension can be adjusted, giving drivers the option of a more relaxed ride or an aggressive setting. Regenerative braking enhances the car's range by recovering energy lost while braking and delivering a consistent, smooth braking sensation. The battery management system in the car makes sure that the temperature and performance of the battery are at their best, extending the life of the vehicle. Impact on the EV market a noteworthy advancement in the EV industry is the Maserati Gran Turismo EV. It appeals to a wider audience by bringing the legacy and luxury of the Gran Turismo series into the era of electric vehicles. The vehicle competes successfully against other high-end EVs like the Tesla Model S and the Porsche Taycan thanks to its remarkable features and performance. The Gran Turismo is a high performance sports car, so the introduction of an electric version might help disprove the myth that electric vehicles are underpowered or slow. This could encourage more car aficionados to consider switching to electric and help change the general view that electric cars perform less well than gasoline powered vehicles. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.